Now, much has been said about fake news in election season, but what about fake claims? Let's examine the ones that were made today and see how much water they hold. This is an IEW fact check. Claim number one, what Rahul Gandhi said, he said that Prime Minister Modi is weak and Prime Minister Modi is scared of Chinese President Xi Jinping. What does the BJP's track record show? The Do Klam crisis, India stood up to China. The Belt and Road Initiative, India did not give in to Chinese pressure. Delhi still boycotts that project. Kashmir, India has resisted China's repeated efforts to play mediator. If the reference was to the Doklam summit, it's plain wrong because Masood Azhar was never mentioned in Wuhan. It was a reset. The Wuhan summit was a reset, a de-escalation after the Doklam tension, a restart of dialogue, and it, it achieved the intended target, so the government says. Next, we have the BJP claim. Their tweet said that Jawaharlal Nehru gifted a permanent seat of the United Nations Security Council to China. Is that true? To some extent, yes. Nehru wanted to improve India's ties with China and in the bargain, he gave the seat at the United Nations Security Council. It's, it's a matter of documents. It is there for everyone to see. It's also true that Nehru wanted India to be considered for a permanent seat at a later date. We are still waiting for that date. Now for claim number three. Rahul Gandhi said that the National Security Advisor Ajit Doval had escorted Masood Azhar to Kandahar in 1999. This is plain wrong. Ajit Doval was indeed in Kandahar, but he was part of the team of negotiators that went well before Masood Azhar. In fact, Doval did suggest to Brijesh Mishra that Masood Azhar should not be released, but the Atal Bihari Vajpayee government went the other way.